Yeah, I like that. It, it kind of feels like it's chilly today, but with the sunshine, isn't it nice? Mm -hmm. Kind of gives you that, that spring-like vibe. Let me show you what it looks like. We're going to start with the Poconos because, of course, we had the snow this weekend. Gorgeous folks out enjoying it. Look at that blue sky. And more importantly, or at least maybe equally as important, look at the illumination in the sky. The sun now going down almost at 545. So here we are at 615. Clear sky. You still have light out, no question about it. So a brief recap, because of course we had the snow this weekend, 2.6 inches officially in Philly, bringing our February total to 3.2 and our season total in Philadelphia now at 11.2 inches, which is below normal, but it's certainly more than it was last year. And other temperature, other uh, snowfall totals around the region, Allentown, the Lehigh Valley, you folks have had over two feet of snow, officially at 25.2, Trenton over 15 inches, there's our 11.2 in Philly. Wilmington at 11.6 and Atlantic City at 7.3. And when we compare it to where we should be to date, with the exception of the Lehigh Valley, we are still below normal. Philly down 5.8 inches from where we should be. Look at Atlantic City down 6 inches. But at least we've had some snow. If you are a winter lover, we've had some. I don't see any in the near future, though. Outside right now, feels a little chilly. 41 degrees, 36 in Trenton. We have 39 uh, currently around Redding. Notice Mount Pocono at 25. Cold enough to make some more snow tonight for the higher elevations. Wildwood sitting at 40, and it's 34 around Allentown. So for the rest of this evening, clear skies. Grab that coat. You don't have to worry about anything else. Certainly not the umbrella. Winds are light. We dropped to 31 by 11 o'clock. I see us getting to freezing, by the way, tonight, probably between like 9 and 10 p.m. somewhere in there, and eventually dropping down into the mid-20s for Philly, outlying spots into the low 20s, if not teens, for the Lehigh Valley, for example, but a nice clear night out there tonight. And then tomorrow, like today, plenty of sun, a beautiful day, just a little cooler, both the morning low and the afternoon high. 40 degrees, what we're looking at at 5 o'clock. By noon, we're at 38. But it is a dry day around the area. And you can see here, not just locally, but up and down the mid-Atlantic, we have high pressure overhead, so really nothing to speak of of any significance. You have to go all the way out west to find our next weather maker, and it's this system here that is yet another powerhouse for folks in California, certainly the mountainous region, up into parts of Oregon and Washington. That is heading this way. I expect it to be here on Thursday. So for tomorrow, again, sunshine, low 40s. We'll say 45 on Wednesday with some increasing clouds. Thursday night and into Friday. That is when we are watching this system roll through the onset Thursday evening, maybe 9, 10 o'clock, and then overnight and into Friday morning. Notice all the green. This is a rain event, even at 6, 7 o'clock in the morning for all locations. Friday by noon, still tracking showers. It starts to taper off if you have plans Friday evening. It looks to dry things out. Temperatures are going to be in the 50s. The weekend a bit cooler, but uh, it is looking dry at this point. We'll keep you updated. Not weather alert worthy at this point, but we'll watch it and let you know. Guys, back over to you. My man, thank you, sir.